Hey everybody. Hello. We are at our milk spot. Crooked Creek Dairy Farm. Farm Dairy. Crooked Creek Farm Dairy. Established 1981. Reading the sign off of the uh, the storefront. Andrew loves their milk here. We literally pass maybe three stores. Actually, we just like come into the to the original location. There's a store up the corner from us that actually sells their milk sells the milk that andrew likes but andrew likes coming here um it's a little bit further of a drive obviously but the drive is always nice the visit is always nice so yeah we really like it um they have what is called cream line milk and what cream line milk is it's basically a it's non-homogenized milk so there's i don't want to go into the details right now but um essentially what happens is when you go to the for my canadians out there you guys know what homo milk is or homogenized milk it's uh what they do is they pass the milk through a very small orifice and it basically homogenizes or makes one the um the liquid and the fat of the milk so um or the milk and the cream so it doesn't separate um you can just grab your milk and just pour it and you're good to go. With cream line milk, you got to shake it because what happens is because it's not homogenized, it doesn't go through that process, it uh, it actually separates. So the cream um, settles on top and then you got your milk on your bottom. So you just got to take your jug and just shake it around a little bit before you pour yourself a glass. Um, it's very nice. It's super delicious. and It's, it's very nice in lattes. It's very mm. delicious in lattes. And with um, Rebecca's famous chocolate chip cookies. <laughs> cookies so I made they're... one time. <laughs> Whatever. They're famous. And you sent me the recipe. Doesn't matter. <laughs> they're so good. They're uh, good. We'll talk they about, are good. We'll talk about cookies in another video. But yeah. These are the best cookies ever. Anyways, homo non-homogenized milk is easy, it's better for your body. It's easier for, for it to... Uh, to absorb the nutrients and um for the longest time we were drinking um oat milk oat juice from milk oats don't make milk but i was calling it oat milk i got i got bamboozled and then we started looking a little bit closer at the um ingredients and they were no bueno yeah not good at all so went back to regular milk mm -hmm. sure cream line milk it is Thankfully, Crooked Creek, uh, what is this, 35 mile? Uh, yeah, 35. Um, yeah, 35 mile. Um, There's usually cows out, but... Yeah, we'll go, we'll take a little walk. Um, yeah. Cows aren't out today, so we won't be seeing the cows. That's okay. That's yeah, it's okay. The goats are out, so we'll go check them out. Just left the key in the ignition. Ah, so those little hut looking things are where the uh the calves do their hey, thing baby, 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 in the baby, spring baby. but it is the fall and those guys are probably somewhere in the back but these guys they're always chilling and having a good time Whoop, a little muddy trying not to get too muddy but some of these are probably the baby ones we saw in the spring yeah it's very true there was a bunch of baby goats and I don't know how quickly goats grow, but I wouldn't be surprised. Oh, take that smelling. <laughs> <sighs> I love the smell of a farm. You love the smell of farm? Yeah. Is that what you said? Yeah. It's got a little earthiness. Some people say it smells like poop, but. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so here we are. Um, that's the storefront. Um, very cool spot uh, in the summertime. Well, year-round, it's really cool. Uh, a lot of history. A lot of history. They've been here for a minute. One lady said she only this buys her farm milk and meat is, from here. I'm going to kind of walk a little bit to the front here um, so you guys can see a little. It's a little let me try and zoom in a little bit. But uh, what do we say here? Ooh. Oh, this farm is environmentally verified. Livestock system, cropping system. So pretty cool. All right, and the storefront. Uh, did you grab a five from the? Uh, yeah, I'll grab one. Please. Is that unlocked? So the storefront, they are open, I think, seven days a week until yeah. seven o'clock. 
Even tonight, even on a Sunday, they're open till seven. So it's super convenient as, yeah, it's Sunday and they're open till seven. So um, yeah, go in and they do have ice cream. We got a lot of cool stuff. A lot of um, handmade products, very cool. It smells so good in here too. Excuse me. A lot of, lot of cool me. stuff. A lot of naturopath items. These stuff are so good. The uh, Dr. Bronner's, if you guys have never tried any of these products, highly recommend. They J. Have R. Christmas stuff out. These soaps, if you guys have never tried Dr. Bronner soaps, you're missing out. Please, if you see them, grab them. They got a lot of, a lot of cool stuff in here. The Naked Bee hand and body lotions, plus some other products, shampoos, washes, Ooh. some CBD products. A lot, a lot of cool stuff, a lot of cool stuff. Um, as always in Michigan, a lot of maple syrups and a variety of honeys. Oh, look at this. These ones are made in Elmont. Oh, they got uh, honeycomb. honeycomb, yeah, from Elmont, which is not too far from where we're at. Some Bob's Red Mills. Um, yeah, a lot of stuff. They've got um, ice creams, their own um, their own brand, Crooked Creek ice creams. You can get them in tubs, but they also have have them in the back here where you can uh, latte. Mucha latte. <laughs> Ooh, it's funny. Very cool. I'm gonna have to try that one of these days. Yeah, I like the name. That's Mackinac funny. Island Fudge. They got a lot of stuff. They got a lot of. Um, Meats, meat pasties, products. They got pasties. You can see, oh, the Chuck's, Chuck Steak's five ninety nine a pound. Is that good? Brisket's six ninety nine, and it's really good beef. Uh, I mean, obviously it's going to be a little bit on the, little bit on the, wait, no way. I'm seeing oxtail for five nineteen a pound. Is that that's good? That's like half price of what, that's insane. I wonder if they but, have any. Let's see if um, they have any. Yeah, I just don't open it up. Short ribs, two seventy nine a pound. That doesn't seem right. They got right. beef liver. How much is the beef liver? Something or doesn't seem right here. How is how are short ribs two seventy nine a pound? That's way too good of a price. Oh, they got tongue for Alita, five ninety nine a pound. Alita, that's for you. Beef ribs, three ninety nine a pound. They have some really good prices. I don't see the oxtail. Sorry. That's all right. I'm sure if we ask we somebody for help, they'd be able to uh, help us to, out. Like, dick but it. Uh, they got a bunch of cool stuff in here, guys. Um, you could really spend uh, a good good amount of time in here. Popcorn, cane sugars, pearled barley, one of my favorites, oats. Oh, they got merch. I didn't even see that. They got merch. Oh, nice. Very cool. I've never saw that either. Crooked cream merch. Ooh, very nice. Might have to uh, grab something one of these days, mm -hmm. for sure. Um, and then the good stuff in the back. Cream really line, over the whole milk. Stuff. They've got, uh, like I said, this is the stuff that I usually get, the cream line. Uh, they got a bunch of other stuff. They've got smaller jugs, um, regular non, like your whole milk that's homogenized, 2%. They have goat's milk, chocolate milk. Uh, they got a bunch of stuff. Um, so we will get a gallon of cream line, whoops. They mean to let that slam. But uh, yeah, they got a bunch of stuff here, guys. So if you haven't, I really recommend it. Roll butter. Summer sausage. Some big rolls of butter. Uh, they got some sausages. Big rolls of butter. Lots of cool stuff, yeah. Very cool. Mac and cheese bites. Very nice. And then some more stuff on this side. Some cool little mugs, really cool stuff for the kitchen. Coffee, teas, some more oats, walnut creek, jams. Jams. Very nice, very nice. Alrighty. Ooh, and then again, you guys like fudge. It's they do have so fudge. Good.
Ready. All right, so back in the van, uh, and we got our Creamline milk, so. <sighs> I wish it was a little more, well, I should say I wish. Um, because I got ice cream, and it's a little too cold for yeah for ice cream right now. Maybe hot cocoa. Do they have hot cocoa? No. Oh. But that would be. That cider mill had hot cocoa. The best right now. Maybe next it's time. It's so cold. Yeah, yeah, next time. Um, but yeah, so Crooked Creek Farm We're Dairy. It's cold. It's 50 degrees. 50 Fahrenheit. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that is. In Celsius. It's gonna get, it's gonna uh, get colder. It's, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, so thank you guys. Appreciate you tuning in. And um, yeah, until next time. This was, uh, we try and come maybe like once a week, but um, yeah. Once every couple weeks. Yeah, sorry, not once a week. What am I saying? We don't go through milk that quickly. But um, when is this milk? It's good till October 30th. So a um, couple weeks. I was always curious what the shelf life was, but uh, yeah, what's the date today? Uh, 14, 15th? Yeah, so 15 days, two weeks. Yeah, Just over two weeks. weeks. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it's pretty good. Um, but yeah, guys, we're heading back to uh, Macomb. We're gonna chill out for the rest of the day. It's Sunday, put our feet up, kick back, and just we'll chill out. watch a movie. Yeah, we'll see, maybe do a little movie action. Um, maybe make some popcorn. I don't know, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, it looks like some popcorn. You want some popcorn? Yeah. Uh, I think I'm gonna be making some popcorn tonight. <laughs> um, but yeah, all right, thanks guys, appreciate it. Bye. What like and to say? subscribe to his channel we're gonna have to work on that <laughs> but as you said please like subscribe comment you know let us know i'm sure there's yeah, a let lot us of know if you want to see anything yeah you... definitely check things out we love seeing new places if you want to see new stuff new to us new to you guys or even if it's let them know yeah, let stuff them that know. you guys have been to we've never like she yeah. said new to us we're always out and about gallivanting. Um, I'm gonna try and put out some like cooking stuff as well. Uh, for those who do know me, I love to cook. Um, and then I just, I need lights. It's just a little dark in our kitchen right now. So it's hard for me to uh, to get like quality content for you guys. So I'm just kind of, I'm holding back until I can figure out the light situation. But we'll figure that out. But like I said, for just now, any, any, any... Um, suggestions, suggestions, let them know. Yeah, just throw us in the comments. Things that we can do to improve our video content, quality, everything, just let us know. I know I'm struggling for with a bit with this gimbal, learning how to keep things in frame. I'm I always moving around. You're doing a good around. job. <laughs> um, okay, you're not like Pat, so. But um, where I need to look, I think I gotta look right there. Right there, right there. Um, but yeah, we'll get there. Just give us some time, guys. We're, we're keep rookies. keep watching. We're trying. Uh, keep but, watching, keep liking, subscribe yeah, to his channel. And uh, <laughs> just, uh, yeah, appreciate the support. And uh, we'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. Bye. Stop.